fun, a lot of fun. It's not every day that as conservative a driver as me gets to pretend that he's such a demon on wheels. Well, the gimbal is this massive robotic arm that just kind of whips you around and gives you whiplash. You know, you have to pretend that you're on a road driving, but you're not the whole time. Green screen, you know, it's a bit of a nightmare at times, but you just have to pretend that stuff's there, and eventually you start having fun with the idea of just make-believe, you know. It's like being a little kid again. You're like, oh, I see the car, sort of, in my mind. When when he's in the when he's in the car, you know, it gets so frustrated, the road and stuff. And that's how I felt when I was on the gimbal. I'd be so frustrated because it was so uncomfortable at times. You know, this thing was whipping you around, and, and so I'd really get kind of crazy. But when I'm out of the car, you know, I'd be very comfortable, and speed is kind of very relaxed and cool. Speed's kind of got these two personalities. You know, one, he's a demon on wheels, but he's kind of a, a mellow guy when he's off the road. The jump jack flip is just something that I just, I, I love. And any kind of surreal thing, like being able to hit a button and your car does a back flip is, is pretty cool. Believe it or not, the show, they actually had reruns on Cartoon Network. So I actually, I did watch it growing up. I was big into Speed Racer growing up with it. I was like, oh man, I used to watch this show when I was six years old on Cartoon Network every day. Um, and then when I heard the Wachowskis were doing it, it was like, whoa, Wachowskis. Like, the Matrix is one of the greatest movies ever. My mind was so blown. I mean, I think that they did it again. They're, it's just, a, I love the movie. It's so great. It's so psychedelic and just colorful and crazy and, you know, fun. I worked with these uh, stunt coordinators, Chad and Dave, who are just some of the toughest guys you'll ever hang out with. And they, you know, their whole goal was to just toughen me up and put me through some, through some fight training. It was like, you know, the sequence in The Karate Kid where the guy's being trained, he's like, Ugh, uh, you know, it was like that for a couple months.